So step one, we'd start with the scalp. We have these custom scalp molds that are patient specific. We're gonna mix some silicone together, add some dye to mimic the skin tone. We actually machine skulls out of a block of plastic. You'll see the machinist go in and a anatomically accurate skull come out of a chunk of plastic. Third step will be assembling the brain. That starts actually the night before, where we will pour a custom hydro shell into a proxy mold. And the mold is built from the MRI of the patient that we're building the brain from. We'll freeze that overnight. So your brain has two types of blood vessels in it. It has veins and arteries. Arteries bring the blood in and veins bring the blood out. You can see where the blood flow is. And so from the scan, we can extract that region right where we're gonna drill the hole and then 3D print those veins. To make the head, we'll use the CT scan from our participants. We'll convert that into a 3D model and then 3D print it here at Neuralink. So we basically have someone's full head from the neck up with a hole in it that will fit the skull cap and the brain. That whole assembly will go inside of the head and it's ready to ship off for surgery.